I think that um, families of all ages and backgrounds and uh, income levels need uh, help in today's world. There's over 9,000 nonprofits in the North Texas area and without community service none of them would exist. I've been a Big Brother uh, through Big Brothers Big Sisters for almost four years now and my little brother Anthony has completely changed my life. And I found a little boy digging through the dumpster. I've never seen anything like that. This woman um, was in pain and um, and I couldn't do anything and that felt so wrong. I had an 18 year old girl with a 15 month old son who couldn't make her rent. And it occurred to me, I am able to feed my family of six for less than two dollars. If people don't, people don't need to be hungry. And Sue Hesseltine, our executive director, said, oh, well, we don't put doors on our cabinets because we want our girls to always see that there's food. And I'm like, that was the moment that I knew that I will always be part of that organization. And we receive a lot more from it than they do. I get more out of it than what I put in. It comes back tenfold. If I can help one person, it's a great day. If I can help five people, it's a Yahoo day. Community service is about everybody joining hands to create the kind of healthy community that they want for their family. We have been given the commission to take care of our fellow man, uh, to help the downtrodden, to help the, the poor. I've had a lot of opportunities in my life that were given to me because of who, where I was born. And um, I, I just want to see everyone have an equal playing field. We create a ripple effect. You're a single drop with a single individual and that person goes and changes their life and changes the community around them. But it's the volunteers that come in and they put in the hours and they take an interest in the children and they want to help and that that's priceless. If everyone did community service, can you imagine how it would cut down on the welfare agencies and the programs? It's in our own personal self-interest to see that wouldn't it be wonderful if everybody could lead a life as blessed, for example, as mine has been. But if enough people, not just one, but enough people come together and say, we do care. I hope that, well, I know that Safe Haven saves lives. Um, and I'm just honored to, to be a part of that journey with those women and children. I've been doing it 12 years and I can't imagine not doing it. There's nothing else I would stop doing this to do. It has changed my, my life different ways, but for me the most valuable is the context that I have made, the relationships that I have built. We are gonna pick up this trash. We are gonna go down to the homeless shelter and take care of these people. We are gonna mentor these children. That's what's gonna change the world.